master of my fate. I am the captain of my soul. I witnessed something profound while covering a memorial for George Floyd in Brooklyn on Thursday, the strength of the human spirit in the face of adversity. The memorial in Brooklyn for George Floyd was cathartic. Hundreds who had gathered marched across the Brooklyn Bridge in a massive show of mourning. Members of the Alpha Phi Alpha fraternity were at the front of the line, peacefully uh, marching. Halfway across the Brooklyn Bridge, the fraternity stopped for an exceptional moment. They recited a poem, Invictus, by William Ernest Henley. Invictus is not a mournful poem, but it speaks to a crucial component of what this country is experiencing right now, the strength of the human spirit to overcome the darkest and most painful experiences by drawing from within ourselves the fortitude to continue to survive, to live, to fight another day. I know the poem well because I'm the child and grandchild of anti-apartheid activists. I'm a descendant of people whose activism was and is encapsulated by that poem. My parents and my sister were forced out of their land simply because of the color of their skin. Invictus was Nelson Mandela's favorite poem. It inspired Mandela and his, and his fellow prisoners to endure the years of imprisonment under the racist apartheid regime, and it's as timely now as it was when he recited it time after time in prison. I'm going to read you the first stanza of the poem, and then you'll hear the rest of it from the members of the Alpha Phi Alpha fraternity on the Brooklyn Bridge. Out of the night that covers me, black as the pit from pole to pole, I thank whatever gods may be for my unconquerable soul. In the sun of the sun's face, I will not wait to cry aloud. Under the blessings of the saints, my head is bloody but I'm loud. Beyond the grace of God is it, blue for the horror of the shade. The end of the night is every day, fire is not hardly on the prairie. The red cloud is every day, I'm charged to burn the prison scroll. I am master of my fate, I am the captain of my soul. To be the captain of your soul is the thing no one can take from you. To be the master of your fate is a decision that you will not be a victim to it. Hear that last part again, paraphrased by Nelson Mandela himself, when he received an honorary doctorate from Howard University in 1994, months after he was elected the president of South Africa. I am able to say, I am captain of my soul. I am master of my fate. I thank you. 